because all I'm seeing here is people insulting right, you. Right, okay. So Where so is your life being at you risk? Want me to respond on there you go. Right. But no, point out right. to me. So Matthew right, 5 so 38. We, we so ask questions. One second, one second. Yeah, one second. Yeah, point out, please. Right. So let's do a live practical example of this, right? Point out, please. If I was to slap you in a, if, if if there was a line of ten people that were gonna slap no no, we're gonna be practical go on, go on. because this verse is basically invoking. Go on. Point out, please. This verse I'm, I'm, is I'm waiting for it. That you shall not defend yourself. So you have oh, 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 where? Wait, hold where? On. No, show me. Show me where. Show me where. Let's read it. Right here. Read it. Read it again, read it again. No. This is the problem with Jesus' right. This is the problem with you guys. You have heard uh -huh. it was said, an yep. eye for an eye. No, it's an eye for an eye no, defending on, yourself. Let me finish. It's an eye for an eye defending yourself. Be respectful. Okay. Be respectful. Go Am for I it. not being respectful? Um, well, you're wishy-washy on, on, on that one, right? But don't forget, allow me to finish. hold on now, I want us to make clear what we're talking about. You were saying that that advice is impractical. I'm going to stay because, silent. You're awesome. You you're finish. saying that advice is impractical because if your life is at risk, it is removing from you the ability to defend your own life. Show me that in the text. Right. Are you ready for, the, for our response, right? So. Now listen carefully, right? And we're going to do a live practical example of this verse and let's see if we can administer this verse in real time. Fair? Right? Because you believe that this is this is the final dispensation of God. So therefore, it shall it should be, at best, something practical as well. But so we're not Salafists. Okay, okay, that's the thing. Finished, we're not Salafists and we understand that Christ spoke in parables. Allow me to finish. So there you go. Allow me to finish. Don't worry, carry on. Otherwise, I am waiting for it and you better show me from that verse. Otherwise, otherwise you're full of crap. Otherwise, carry on. Take a hike. Thank you very much. Oh, no, don't worry. You hike because you're going to run away. And I, I, I asked that where, 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 where those shoes aren't going to help you very much. Right. Okay. Hopefully you have a change of shoes in your bag. You have heard that it was said, uh -huh. an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. Revenge, you know? But I say, uh -huh. right? the lawgiver, the Lord of Lords. Is this the one who is evil? Mm. So if someone came up to you and done you evil, right, according to this verse. It right? specifies the evil, so you're lying. You're generalizing it, it specifies this, you're lying. Carry on. What, what? Your tassia is trash. That's what I'm afraid of. I, I am afraid of, of a trash tassia. Okay, thank you, thank now you carry on. That you're afraid. Of your trash tassia, carry on. Okay, so he's afraid. Thank you, everybody. Of, your, of his trash tassia, carry on. Let's keep going. Keep going. Yeah, going. You have heard that it was said. Oh, okay, let's go back. An eye for an eye. Mm -hmm. Well, I'll continue to repeat until he. Carry on. But you, know what? you Muslims repeat things over and over again. Right? You, you chant right. things. And that's how you understand things. Right. Right. Repeat okay. that over and over again until okay. you get it. You Start you again. Right. Do you, know, do you know? Do you know the, Start the, again. the hilarious thing about this conversation? Start again. He has no confidence in you. That's why he's coming in like this. Brother? Are you confident how, enough to speak to me? Brother? No, no, can I, I be here? How, you know how, how do you know? I'll tell that? you. Yeah, tell me. You. Give us a sassia. Very easy. Very easy. Give us a sassia. No, because not. when I was speaking no. to you, mm -hmm. it, was, it was friendly, it was peaceful. It's still friendly and peaceful. And, and then what's happened clearly. But now you've lost your, faith in your arguments. Your, your That's why you're running. Your ambassador has come up. I am his Christian right. brother. I love this your man. Chief, he gave his life to Christ. And you should too. Amen. Your executive has come over because he can't. I'm only a brother in Christ. So, in other words, he probably feels that you're incompetent. I'm not hearing your tassier. I'm not hearing it. You have heard. Mm. Said an eye for an eye. You're surprised, brother. How you doing? How you doing? But I say to you, do you not resist the one who is evil, right? But if anyone slaps you on the right cheek, mm -hmm. turn to the other. Uh -huh. so now let's test to see the practicality of this. So hold on, finish it off. Line of ten people. Finish it off. If there was a line of ten people. Finish it off. It's not done yet. I'm finish it off. Finish. finish it off. Because now your tap here is trash. Right. Finish it off. Are you ready? Matthew 5:39. Ready? So what's the question? Right. My question is this. Right? Without the rude interruption. Because Kelly has no confidence in you. Right. I have no confidence so, in you. Right. Really. So, yeah. If you're from the No, don't worry. So, I'm going to stay here and make sure that when I leave, I have confidence in you because you have right to have here. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Keep going. Thank you very much. Keep going. Right. So if there was a line I of believe 10 in you, people, man. You're doing great. If there was a line of 10 people that slapped you and did evil to you, according to this verse, it says, right? It says, but I say, do not resist the one who is evil. Do not resist. And so, it specifies so how. Tell me something. Are you going to allow someone to do evil to you and disobey Jesus? Yes or no? According to this, please, respond. You're not done yet. Let him finish the entire thing. Then we respond. Finish. You see how he's finish it. You see how he's finished? Finish it. it You're reading the verse in part. Finish it. I want you to give the three examples and then we'll talk about them. Finish it. Carry on. Can you, can you, can you finish it. 
Okay, give me your question. Finish it. Okay, so my question is this. Right? Right. You, this, this gentleman pointed out to Matthew 5... 38, 39. He says, you have heard that it was said, an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. But I say, so now Jesus is saying. Mm, the Lord Jesus, is giving the law. superseding what clearly is... Because he right? is the Lord of the Sabbath. Right. So it says, Matthew 12. But I say to you, do not resist the one who is evil. But if anyone slaps you on the right cheek, turn him the other also. Finish it. if anyone Good job. sue you, mm -hmm. take your tunic, mm -hmm. let him have your cloak. Yep. And if anyone forces you to go one mile, yep. then go with him two miles. Uh -huh. Give the one who begs from you, yep. and do not refuse the one who will borrow from you. Okay. So now let's look at awesome. the practicality. So I've read it. Awesome. I haven't put any, step one, you've read it. Step one. Can you allow me to finish? Now, step two. Can you allow me to finish? I want you to tell allow me, me to finish. is that a parable uh, or is that a literal allow command? Me to finish. Allow me to finish. Good. Thank you very much. Without all the disturbances. No, don't worry. You're right. doing this my way eventually. So now, you've read the so entire now, thing. So now, now, tell me what it means. So now, let me finish. Don't worry. Right. I believe in you. So now, my faith is increasing. I'm asking you this question, my friend, right? If there was a line of 10 people who wanted to slap you and do evil according to this verse, Jesus saying you should allow that to happen. Is that what the verse right? means? Right. You should allow that to is happen. Is that what it means? So okay, now, step two. You your tax here is bad. You, so, you I reject your example. Oh, no. Hold on. Show me that in the text. So, first of all, yes. you're saying yes or no, like it's binary. Yeah. Like, it's like, like either yes or no. This is the Quran, bro. Off the cliff or don't but, jump No, there's off. a reason why I'm asking. No, no. Because, because you're misunderstanding you, things. But nothing has to be just yes or no. Mm -hmm. I agree with you. I accept so, that. This is one of them. No, but you're accept. commanding me to say no, but yes or no. No, but there's a yes or no. No, there's so, a reason why I'm asking this. Oh, what's your reason? Right, good. The reason why I'm asking that question is because it's verbatim, right? It's clearly in the text itself, right? Wait a minute. Are you, verbatim, but literal. Are you, are you, are you is it literal? literal? Are you solar scriptura? Is it literal? Do you, do you take this as the revelation? As a, as a revelation? Even solar scriptura doesn't regard the entire Bible as being literal. Do you take... Christian, do you accept Christian scholarship or are you solid? Okay, okay, fine. Show me Christian scholarship that tells you that that verse means you, you can't have about four places. Yeah. I don't know where you want to go. Stick to the verse, though. So, I know, all I want to say is, he, he, he's already read the verse now. Jesus. Now, what I want to know is, he's a Salafist, he, he, so, he, so he, he, he believes that whenever the Quran talks about Allah having hands, right? Allah has literal hands, right? Brother. Stupid, right? That's I know. Fine. Now, fine. what I want him to know is, the, 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 um, the is, is instance is given of this line of 10 people. Is the verse telling you that there are only three ways that you can forgive somebody for doing you wrong? When they slap you, ask for your tunic, and when they run How do I clean myself when I go to the toilet? Exactly! Should I use a leaf? Should I use a Oh, three stones, oh, yeah. Look, my friend. Yeah, let's listen this. It's fine. It's fine. So, if you're unable to answer this, that's fine. No, awesome. Let's see how he's just trying yeah. to try it out. Uh, man, yes. So, yeah. now, uh, it's Hamza, correct? So, now, so Hamza, so now, here's the correct no, no, tafsir. No, 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 no. no. You are wrong. I'm going to correct you. I'm going to correct you. Here's the right tafsir. This is regarding retaliation. The very first verse in 38 says, You have heard it say, an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, aka seeking revenge in. Now, it gives you three instances. Getting slapped, having someone take your tunic, and then being forced to walk a mile. These are not life threatening. These are only insults against your character. So, for example, when you keep saying that Jesus Christ is only a prophet, you are insulting me as a Christian because you're telling me that I dedicated my life to only a prophet. But in retaliation, I don't hurt you. I instead want Wait to preach the gospel to you. And that is what this verse means. So whenever we Christians preach the gospel to you, we are applying this verse. So Hamza, like I told you, you're going to run. And your shoes are going to hold your feet. I'm okay. setting a lot of self-gratification or seeking. Oh, sorry, I keep on to you. I'm trying to shut... Basic, I know what you're doing. Do you, do you know what? Do, do you know what the issue? Oh, is? I was just saying, nice. Do you know what the issue is? Do you know what the issue is? Let me explain to you what the issue is. I am. You have a have, script, and then you can deviate from the script. So you can have a direct conversation. That's what you're for me. I'm trying to have a conducive, meaningful dialogue. This conversation is not about winning or losing. Right? It's about you coming the Christ. This I agree. Not, this conversation is not about... It's about, it's about winning you souls. Or you lose well, the souls in regards, so your soul could be lost. It's about... Who is upon the truth, right? Who is upon the truth? Okay. Now, I believe you're upon the truth. Yeah, I do believe that. But Why do you believe that? Prove it, please. Okay. So, 
I gave you a live practical example. Oh, if you bring on truth. I, bring, I, I, I gave a live practical example of a verse yeah. where Jesus said that if someone slaps you, then offer him the other cheek. If someone does evil to you, now whether that do you be understand a parable, no, no, I do. I clearly do. Explain this. Now, whether that be a parable, let me hear the explanation. Whether that be a parable or something literal, right? There's a problem with both. Both ways of give us both. Image. Give us both. If it was literal, then it can't be a form of, of a form of advice. Why are you saying it right? can't be? Mm. You're saying it can't no, be. That's no, you. No, you're right. Hamza. Deep dive into it. Let's hear it. I will, I will explain my Let's hear it. Well. That's right? you. I would never advise. I would never advise anybody, right, to allow someone else to oppress you and allow the oppression to continue. Because that is not. Then you can be a Muslim. That's not practical. <laughs> then you can't be a Muslim. That is not practical. Then you can't be a Muslim. You don't believe in this here. You know what? You know so what? So you've left Islam now. It's, it's funny. You've left Islam. It's I great. I love it. Look, no, no, you're not Muslim anymore. I am the one being insincere. But I am the no, one. No, I am also, being completely sincere when I am listening I am very intently to what you're saying and responding in I kind. I am being completely honest with you and I am not lying about anything you're saying. So you just said very, very clearly that you cannot advise anybody to continue to be oppressed. In that case, you're no longer a Muslim. You are not on the sinner because now you're not anymore. Whether someone's right or wrong, then what would you would you be seeking? To do your scripts. Because you, you said you're neither here to say whether someone is right or wrong. But then that makes you insincere because you're not seeking truth. If you're not seeking right or wrong, then what are you doing? Do you believe that you're on the truth? Absolutely. Eh, eh. You won the last one. So, so therefore, Finish it off. what we should do... Right, and we're on the truth because... Mohammed? A mutual exchange, and then we will see sure thing. from that mutual Less exchange. Less time. At the end of the day, my friend. How many minutes do you want? You know that I'm being very. No, hold on. How many minutes do you want? You know that I'm Two being or five? What do you want? You. I have not. I have not. I have not said anything blasphemous. How, how many minutes do you want? I have not disrespected. Well, I have not mentioned anything like that. Though. Exactly. It's, I agree. It's almost what, like you've turned the cheek. Doing, what he's, he's stopping you from listening to me, and I can see why. Ah. It, because because clearly, I from what this just purely from an outside of observation, he doesn't have confidence in your answers. I I haven't got confidence in your answers. You know, so therefore, he's stopping you from engaging with me. And that's have I stopped you? Listen, let's just say, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ask any Christian dodging. Most Christians with part Ladies me. and gentlemen, this is a live Christian. example of Dawa dodging. And, he does and he's going to run for me in his brown shoes that aren't made for running. Let me just say yeah. that you might be right in what you're saying. Let's just say, okay, let's just put it out there, right? If he's here, he's helping me. No, that's not po- Subhanallah! Because, I say, Subhanallah! That's what I'm going to say. Because I know the truth. I have no issues. So, hear me out. I have no issues with someone seeking assistance. You keep interrupting that's him, no by issue. the way. That's no issue. I have so no issue. let him finish his thought first before you I jump have. in. You, Clint, I was doing that to that you, and you have a problem you with that. Me, so let him finish first. Me, Stop interrupting every five words he says. That's what I'm going to say. And as I was giving my what my thoughts were, then you weren't giving your understanding. Was constantly if you see me as an ambassador, thank you, I appreciate it. When you understand, so, that question. When you understand that you cannot know God unless you accept Jesus Christ, when you understand that, then you will truly know what God is. So you know sure. Okay. So you do. Okay, so let's let's, let's believe let's, let's, you do. Okay, so let's question that. Let's, let's Hold let's, on, let's, we weren't done let's, here. Let's, we weren't let's, done let's, here. Let's, what let's, does this verse mean? Before so you jump, what does this verse mean? Can you do me one favor? Okay. Can you so are you, to, uh, to, to, are you willing to you, admit can you that you don't quiet? have the correct I, 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 I don't want to do that. Please. I don't, don't want to do that. that because so, Matthew 5.38, you, you, you know what it means. So, Hamza, Matthew... You're right. You want to You want to What do you want? 2 or 5? What do you want? I don't want to engage with you. Oh, because like every Dalagandist in this park, you're afraid to hear the hack. You're right. I agree The words of Jesus Christ. And I'm happy to. Okay. I love it. Do you know why? You don't know God. You I'll know, tell you why. Because you know I'm not. Resp- you know I'm not a rude Muslim. You know me. I've known you for a long time. Do you know why? You know I'm a peaceful That's person. Do you know why? He's you not being respectful. Do you know why sorry, you don't know God? Me. Okay, go on. Sorry. No, no. Have a time if he's not respectful. Yeah, then go yeah, yeah, me. Yeah, what do you want? five. Okay, I'll tell you what. Two minutes each, right? Two minutes each. Sure. You have two minutes. I have two. Minutes. And I have two too. And then it's it's a, it's a respectful dialogue. That's it. All right. So we all got two minutes. I don't think I'm being unreasonable. I'm down. Who do you want to start? Shall start? So I let them start. Yep. Yeah. Oh no! The 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 dialogue, dialogue of prophets. Unless you want to have a conversation. Oh no! The the dialogue of prophets. 
Are we doing dollar for Allah or dollar for the YouTube box? No, it's not. It's not. Oh, so uh, um, uh, I, I stuck for Allah. Oh, what's going on here? Look, look at this. Dollar for YouTube money. Hey, See, this is how we are different from the Muslims. Yep, no problem. Do one second, one second. So, effectively, what's going on here, guys, is that we have been here with Hamza. And Hamza is uh, harping on Matthew 5.38. So Hamza is implying that Christ is giving us impractical advice that puts our own lives at risk. Because he is telling us that we cannot defend ourselves if a murderer comes into our house to kill us. We should instead offer him our firstborn as a sacrifice. Hamza has trashed Tafsir, he's a Salafist. Those guys are in BTEC. Don't listen to anything they say. The verse is concerning retaliation. Having a vengeful heart and a vengeful spirit, like the Jews of old, with the eye for an eye, very similar to, for example, Hammurabi's law. It is not fair and it is not just. If we are claiming to follow God, claiming to follow the truth, then we must be able to show that we are with God in the fruit of our actions. Here's the thing, I'm not going to articulate this and do it enough justice, but... There is no way, I, I want anyone to sort of tell me any other way that could be more humble and sincere than the Almighty to come upon us, fully God, fully man, to represent himself and to show us the errors of our ways. There, there is no other way for him to reveal this in a, in a purer form. There is no purer sense. I, I don't know. It, do Muslims think he's going to come out, jump out of the sky and... Who, 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 uh... Descend on... According to the tradition, yeah, nonsense. Uh, that's something I'd expect from so-called King Charles, right? Mm. That's what I expect, yep. you know, in his little golden chariot, yep. on his way to the hospital, yep. to fix his prostate because yep. he seems to think he's his own creator. You know? These people in power, I mean, who the hell do they think they are? He's gone to the bloody hospital because he's probably got prostate cancer. Maybe, I mean, maybe, right? If he's so powerful, so knowing, so wise, can he not live forever? Does he not know how to? Can he not teach us? Why do you call yourself a king? You shall call no one rabbi or king but I. Or teacher. The Lord. There's only one. There's Amen. Only one. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Ultimately, the verse is about retaliation. If we are supposedly following Christ, must we retaliate yeah, to everything? Absolutely. And it doesn't have to be simply physical uh, hurt that's been done to you. No, no, no. Whenever these Muslims tell us that Christ is not God, they are insulting our king. <laughs> and every time that happens, we could punch them in the face. Of course. But, but we, we don't. don't. And that's the difference. Subhanallah. And that's the difference. Subhanallah. You know, there you go. The fr you shall know them by their fruit. You shall reap what you sow. A good tree so cannot produce fruit. bad fruits, and a bad tree cannot produce good fruits. Amen. Amen. Stay blessed. Stay blessed.